Good evening, this is Victor Echo 6, Bravo Tango Charlie. The name here is James. Uh, my QTH is Edmonton, Alberta. And uh, I noticed a few members of my club, which is the Northern Alberta Radio Club, have started getting interested in fox hunting. Um, as far as I know, we only have really one member in the club that has an actual fox, and I thought I'd try and whip together one uh, that could be used for the club and also for some training and practices and as a demonstration. Um, so there's a couple things we need. We need our Arduino, a power source, and a radio, uh, in this case the Beofang UV5R. The Beofang UV5R five R in order to trigger the PTT uh, it actually pulls to ground so for that we need to make a cable uh, as you can see I've got a real hodgepodge of a cable it's a bunch of electrical tape and I think some old uh, two pair I had laying around for telephones um, we also need a pin header excuse me I only got one hand such as this to connect to our Arduino. Alright, so in order to make this cable we need a few things. We need the 3.5 millimeter audio jack uh, stereo, a 2.5 millimeter audio jack which can be mono, a 5 volt relay that uh, connects to the Arduino, um, and a bunch of cable. So. Preferably, if you have a shielded cable, I'd highly recommend using that because this will do some naughty things if you don't, and I'll demonstrate that in a minute. Um, on the relay, um, basically we have the normally closed position, we have a normally open position. We're not going to use that pin. Um, on the normally closed side, or sorry, normally open side, um, we have a line that goes to the Arduino ground and we have a line that goes to our speaker ground which is just a single wire that goes to this 2.5 millimeter uh, plug. Um, I also put a bridge here on the relay to bridge the Arduino ground and the radio ground at the relay side so that we wouldn't have to mess with that on the Arduino side. It just makes it easier to use on a cable itself. Um, we have our coil here. Um, the coil, obviously the positive side is going to go to the Arduino, which is going to be going to pin 11, which is the TX trigger. And we have the negative, of course, going to our speaker. Uh, and that's going to go to the tip of the 2.5. I will have this picture as a photo on the NARC forums, which is narc.net. On the common of the relay, this is going to go to our PTT, which is going to go to this first position on the 3.5 millimeter jack. And then we also need to feed audio to the radio itself. Um, we do that by running from pin 12 of the Arduino to the second position back from the tip of the 3.5 millimeter jack. So I will also post the code on the website. So let's power this up and see what happens. Let's connect our power source. Our power source is connected. I am tuned to, I don't know if you can see that, 146.565. And I also have that on my scanner here. So let's turn this on. Watch what happens. So this is our alert tone. And then remember how I was talking about using a shielded cable? Yeah, that's probably for the best. Just watch what happens when we put the antenna kind of parallel with the cable itself. I'm going to reset this here. Yeah, it doesn't like that. So, should we have a shielded cable? It should be fine.
This is Victor Echo 6, Bravo Tango Charlie, and thank you very much for watching.